Hello and welcome to Sunday's Financial News. And here's what's making the headlines in the markets today. The dollar-yen pair has fallen 0.1% in the last session. The ATR has gradually diminished into the low volatility zone. The price of gold has fallen 0.4% in the last session. The ultimate oscillator transitioned sharply into the negative zone. Bitcoin has fallen 2% in the last session. The highs-lows indicator plunged into negative territory. The Aussie dollar pair has fallen 0.3% in the last three sessions. The stochastic RSI plunged into the negative zone. And now let's hear what our chief analyst picked up for us today. Apple's new iPhones have arrived and there were few surprises because the leaks were dead right. But now Apple has confirmed new details about both the iPhone 12 range and existing models. Bank of Finland governor said he believes a digital euro is very likely to debut in Europe in the next 10 years. Global stock markets mostly retreated as a record number of new coronavirus infections in parts of Europe led investors to shift away from risky assets. Those were today's major economic events and now moving on to world financial headlines. The U.S. NAHB housing market index will be released on Monday at 1200 GMT. The UK public sector net borrowing Wednesday at 400 GMT. The Canadian retail sales Wednesday at 1030 GMT. The Canadian wholesale sales Wednesday at 1030 GMT. New Zealand's trade balance Thursday at 1945 GMT. And the UK retail sales Thursday at 400 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Sunday's market outlook and will tune in tomorrow morning for the latest events in the market.